Hello, everybody. This is Shannon Stocker. All right, we'll give him to Ty. I am here, and while we're waiting for everybody to um, to join us, I am introducing our babies. <laughs> this is, and my children are my babies too. So um, this is Simba. This is Simba. Simba is a Maine Coon kitty. Not the smartest one. Not the smartest, but he is definitely very sweet. And this is the camera, so if you're going to talk to people, that's where you want to go. This is my son, Ty, who has Nugget. You got to hold him up so that they can see. See? There's Nugget. Nugget is a short-haired domestic rescue. He is a super sweetie. And then this is my daughter, Cassidy, who has our miniature Australian Shepherd, Copper. Hey, Copper, they're all so good. Now, I don't know if I'm able to see comments live or not. Um, so I was hopeful that I could because one of the things that I want to be able to do when we are going through and uh, meeting people and talking with you guys is to talk about your names and I don't know if I'm going to be able to see your names or not so do me a favor if you are there and write a comment for me so I can see oh I do hi Joanna I see that there are, <laughs> there are some people that are there so when you're there do me a favor and write your name for me or the kids names because we will do something kind of fun with it in just a little bit. Hi, everybody. Oh, good. I see that there are people here. Hi, Harper. Hi, Judah. Let me see. I'm going to write these names down. Henry and Wonton and Presley and Kennedy. I love it. I think Cole and Avery are there, too. I haven't seen a note from them, but... Um, I think that they're there as well. I got a text from their mom saying that they were going to be there. I'm going to go get. I'm going to go get um our bunny. Can I go get the bunny? No, I'm going to go get. All right, we have another animal that's going to come visit. I think my children are going to go get the rabbit too, so that you all can meet our rabbit. Um, <laughs> somebody just said hi, Ty and Cassidy. Oh, this is this is fun. I think we're trying to figure this out. So first and foremost, I want to give a big shout out and a thank you to Stamola Literary for putting together a schedule. If you haven't been to StamolaLive.com yet to look up, um, they have a bunch of their authors and illustrators doing some really cool things. And I know that everybody probably has some cabin fever right now. Everybody's feeling a little stuck with at home with homeschooling and this is a, a really fun way to work something different into your day with your children. So there are recommended age limits. So please go check it out. See all the all the wonderful things. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I've been doing um, the fat cats. McCecily oh, is here. Hi, Cecily and Michaela and Madison and Mason. And this is Thumper. Can you pull Thumper? Oh, my, oh. my child is tired right now. And that hey, is Thumper. Thumper. We ran downstairs racing for the money. And this is Thumper. And Thumper is a um, Holland Lop. Lop rabbit. Hi, Zachy. It's nice to have you all here with us. All right, go ahead and stand up for me. So be sure to check out all the other events because um, right now this is, it feels good to be able to do something, to give back to people and provide a little bit of a smile in your day. Bad thing so, I can't go get the parrot. Everything that, everything that we can't, yes. I cannot bring my parrot, but I did make a little video because he gets a little nervous around all the other animals. So I had to choose between the parrot and all the other animals. But here is, I don't know if you can see, that's Prozac. He is my Senegal parrot. He is my little happy yes. pill. So there, now he gets a chance to join, join you as well. So see, uh, I have a, a little viewer named Zachy. I have 
a bird named Zach. It's a good name. Hi, Hattie. There's somebody named Hattie there. It's nice to have you, Hattie. Hi, Ashley. Beatrice, what a wonderful name that is. I love it. Bring the parrot next time. I know. I will I will definitely try. Please don't get offended if my mom mispronounces so, one of your names. <laughs> so I have my little helpers today, which I'm very, very, very grateful for. And I want to talk a little bit about the oh fact goodness. that we can tie. Tie that we can all be helpers in good ways. And it's particularly yes. important right now while we're home to do what we can to be helpful, helpful to ourselves, helpful to our parents, helpful to our siblings. It's an important thing to try and do because sometimes when you're little, it feels a little harder to make a difference. Sometimes when you're little, it can, it can feel like it's a little bit more of a challenge. And that's part of what my book is about because it doesn't matter if you're little and it doesn't matter, hi Hazel, it doesn't matter if you're part of a smaller group, you're still important and you are necessary and you matter in this world. And that's a really important message that I want everybody who's here today to walk away with you can make a difference. So that's part of what my book is about. My book is called, Can You Save the Day? Go ahead and take the rabbit back down oh my so gosh. you're not sneezing. Was... My daughter has a little bit of a bunny allergy, which can make caring for a bunny a little tricky. Um, can You Save the Day? We're gonna read it together and we're gonna talk about it a little bit because it is also about how important it is for everybody to have their own role and how everybody is necessary and important. Hi, Carol, it's nice to see you. So first of, first thing that we're gonna do though is talk a little bit about vowels, tie. What are, this is my tie, what are the vowels? A, E, I, O, U, and maybe sometimes Y. A, E, I, O, U, and maybe sometimes Y. So for the purpose of my book, we're gonna talk about the five main ones. A, E, I, O, U, and U, and U. And those vowels are a small part of the alphabet, but they're super important because without them, our words would sound really funny. Harper and Judah were two of the first people to write their names on here. Harper's name, if you took away, what are the vowels in Harper's name? I wrote it down there. Harper, it would be Harper. Harper would be your name. And Judah's name would just be It would be, it would sound pretty funny. Can you try your name right now? Figure out what your name would be. My name would be his name would be T. My really name would be money. Shin. We have Cole and Avery are watching right now. Cole would be cool. And Avery would be. Oh, that one. Fur. Fur would be Avery. Oh. How about we have Henry and Wonton? Cassidy, what would Henry and Wonton be if we took the vowels mm -hmm. away? How would you say. Does Y count? We're. we're not gonna count why, because it'll sound funnier. <laughs> It'd be Henry. What about Wonton? <laughs> my name would be. I only have one letter in my name if you take away the vowels. Yep. One letter, <laughs> one single letter. <laughs> Vivi, Vivi's there. Yes, Vivi would be super fun. Vivi would be. Mm. <laughs> That's all that you would have, baby, if you didn't have your eyes. And how about Presley? Presley would be Presley. Presley. And Kennedy would be Kind. We did Colin Avery. Cecily. Cecily, if we didn't count the Y, would be Sul. Oh Isn't that funny? Can you say that? I know, it's fun. I like that. Michaela would be Mickle. 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 And Madison would be Medicine. <laughs> it sounds almost like medicine. Medicine. 
And my Mason dad, would be Mason. My dad's name would be Burger. Yes, Burgery. and we only have Burgery. a few more. Zachy would be Zuck. Sounds a little like a, an onomatopoeia, which is a word that sounds like it's spelled like that. Zuck. Zuck. And Hattie like, would be Hitt. And Beatrice would be Beatrice. And Hazel would be Hazel. So as you can see, if we took the vowels away, we'd just be left with a bunch of funny sounds and it wouldn't work. So even though the vowels are part of a smaller group, they're so important. So we really want to pay attention to the differences that we can make even though we are smaller. Every little thing's important. Every little thing's important. That's right. Even, even ice cream. <laughs> Even ice cream. We are going to read this. So I'm going to need my lap back, kiddos. But I need my kids here in just a second because we're going to read a book. I mean, sing a song. And when we sing the song, my kids are going to help with some fun posters behind me. With some automatic hits. Can you what? Yes. <laughs> she, we are homeschooling at the same time. We are multitasking here in a big way. She wants to go do her timeline. All right. Can You Save the Day? This is my book. You can see it's written by me, illustrated by Tom Disbury, who has these beautiful, fun illustrations. And I dedicated it to my family. So here we go. I'm gonna put on my glasses so that I can, I can see with my old eyeballs. The letter A sat by a frog and chatted with the duck and dog until the letter B swept by a wicked twinkle in his eye. There are five vowels in your group, but 21 in our grand troop. I'm a more important letter. Consonants are so much better. A knew it only took one hand to count the members in her band, but consonants need all the toes and all the fingers, plus a nose. The letter B stuck out his tongue and bragged, our group is number one. Offended, A said, you'll regret when all the vowels are gone, I bet. Then, poof, like that, A disappeared. That's when things got a little weird. Instead of bark, the dog said, bark. And the duck couldn't quack, she could only quack. And the frog, poor thing, he couldn't croak, he could only crock that woeful bloke. See how cute he is? Croak. The horse laughed. Nay, who needs the A? And turned his back to eat some hay. But then E said, I'm going to, you're being rude. I don't like you. What's gonna happen when E leaves? What do you think's gonna happen? So E took off, things went awry, and all the horse could say was nigh. The birds sang twit instead of tweet, and the sheep just blit instead of bleat. You see how cute they are? Now mean old B just whooped and roared as C through Z laughed in accord. Insulted young I spun her dot and soared off like an astronaut. Turning back, she waved goodbye. And the horse just hung his head to cry. Moop was all that he could utter. Unk was all the pig could mutter. The cow cracked up beside the bunny. They thought it was all too funny. So they sat and watched the fun as A-E-I left one by one. But wouldn't you know, the next to go would be the cow's lone vowel, O, 
mm, was all that she could say when O decided not to stay. The pigeons, too, they couldn't coo, K was all that they could do. And Rooster, I bet you can guess, K he said, distressed. The consonants were so absorbed in laughing that they all ignored a tractor speeding toward their crowd. Fast asleep, ahead it plowed. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> da, da. <laughs> Only you and B observed that tractor as it swung and swerved. Zzz, it snoozed and snored away, gaining speed to B's dismay. Stop! B tried to shout in fear, but stop was all the world could hear. And when he tried to scream, watch out! Watch out! was all that he could spout. Determined, B jumped to his feet and vaulted to the tractor's seat. This was a test, B couldn't flunk. B pushed the horn, the horn went. Funk. So no one heard, no one cared. Be turned to you, a plea prepared, but vowelless words wouldn't flow, so bees unease began to grow. Calmly, you held up her hand. She could make bee understand that yes, indeed, their group was small, but with no vowels, words will stall. So up that you jumped, strong and high, reaching straight up toward the sky. She bent her arms above her head and turned into an O instead. When she did, that horn could sound, honk, the warning shook the ground. The tractor woke with the alert and stopped in time. No one was hurt. See all the letters? You turned toward the consonants, nodded with some confidence, and off she marched to make things right and help the letters reunite. Once A-E-I-O-U came back, the dog could bark, the duck could quack, the frog could croak, the birds could tweet, the horse could neigh, the sheep could bleat, the pig could oink, the cow could moo, the tractor honk, the pigeons coo. And what about that rooster? Yeah, he too could cock-a-doodle-doodle-doo. Sheepishly, the letters shrugged, the consonants and vowels hugged. B said, sorry, now we see the alphabet's a family. Oops. Then a steady voice said, wait, I have one thing that I must state. At times I feel left out, said Y, but you need me to say, Bye-bye. So that is my book from Sleeping Bear Press, Can You Save the Day? We will probably be editing little pieces of that out because we can't have the whole thing online, but we can have pieces of it and we can do the song. Who's ready for a song? Hi, Evelyn. Oh, Katie, I missed which was your favorite page. You'll have to tell me later. I love seeing the comments. Thank you so much, guys, for coming and, and doing this with us. So, this one is yours, Ty. Put that down. All right, I'm going to get my guitar. Hang on, it's right over here. <laughs> my, si my, my psycho sister is starting to steal hey, her chair. Hey, you're going to be nice. I don't care if he calls me psycho, because I probably am. All right, watch out, guys. Yes, my sister is psycho. Take that as some information. Okay, very important. That's a lot of glitter. All right. All my hands are covered in glitter. All right, guys. So here's what we're going to do. I'll stand over here. We are going to, you're going to have to sh hold Wait. those up. Can you hold them up over, like, over my shoulders? There you go. Like, yeah, like that. So when it comes time. Ah, glitter my. When it comes time, that's what you're going to want to do. All right, we're gonna wanna hold it up. So here's what we're gonna do. Not until it's time, though. All glitter. Not until it's time. Oh my gosh. There's so much glitter. Not until it's time, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Here is what we're gonna do. We're gonna sing the chorus. I'm gonna teach you how to sing the chorus and then every single time I sing the chorus, you sing the chorus because it's super easy to do. And there is a music video, by the way, on YouTube where you can go and see a bunch of adorable kids. It's a lot of fun, so look up Can You Save the Day, Shannon Stocker on YouTube and check out the music video. I love it. It was so much fun to do. Can you save the day? 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 So that's the chorus. You all have it? Because we're going to move on now, but I'm going to come back to it. I expect you to join me. Walking around the farm one day, B was bullying A. So with a poof, A disappeared. That's when things got weird. Hi, where are you? The duck would only. The frog would only. The dog would only. That wouldn't work. Can you save the day? 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 I have everybody here? Yeah. The horse left. Oh, Yay! Who needs a yay? But then he said, you're being rude. I don't like you. And the birds could only, the sheep could only, the duck would only, quack, quack, quack. Frog would only the dog would only got that a little mixed up there. That wouldn't work. Can you save the day? 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 After A and E, I and O left to sounds get awfully strange. When there's only you, the cow could only, the rooster only, the birds could only, the sheep could only, the duck could only, the frog could only, the dog could only. That wouldn't work. Can you save the day? 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 I hope y'all are all singing with me. Oh, oops. I forgot. Wait, here comes the scary part of the story. Letters didn't see a tractor plowing straight ahead. Couldn't honk without an O, so B's unease began to grow. So B turned to you and said, Can you save the day? 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 The cow can finally the rooster finally, the birds could finally, the sheep could finally, the duck could finally, quack, 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 the frog could finally, croak, 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 the dog could finally, bark, 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 the tractor finally, honk. when they all could finally see the letters were a family. Can you save the day? 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 I still have glitter in my eye. That is the song. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining us today. Oh I'm so appreciative. And remember, you can. You can save the day. Even if you're little, even if you're part of a small group, you can make a difference just by being kind to somebody, a sweet word, maybe helping put away a stuffed animal, doing your schoolwork without having to be asked a bunch of times, helping to feed the pets, or even just being nice to an animal. A kind word can go a long way. So remember, 
Yes, you can. You can save the day. I loved spending my morning with you guys. I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Mwah. Thank you all for joining us. Bye. Say bye. Bye bye. It's hard to say bye with a fat cat. It is hard to hand. say bye. <laughs> with a fat cat in your hand, especially.